पॉलिसी बाजार पर एक करोड़ रुपए का टर्म लाइफ इंश्योरेंस केवल चार सौ पचास रूपए महीने ऐसी शुरू It's a setback for the Yogi government as the High Court has said no OBC quota is going to be applied in Uttar Pradesh local polls. The High Court has quashed the government notification on local polls. Uh, the High Court has rejected UP government's rapid OBC survey of 2017. The Samajwadi Party Congress had attacked uh, UP government on the OBC quota issue. The SP and the Congress are against local polls uh, uh, minus OBC quota. These are the details that are coming in, which do seem like uh, a setback uh, there to the Yogi government, as the High Court has said no OBC quota in uh, the UP local polls. Uh, they have rejected the rapid OBC survey done in 2017. And remember, uh, at least two of the parties in the opposition, SP and the Congress, had attacked the Uttar Pradesh government on this OBC quota that was uh, uh, that was in fact being based on the survey of 2017. Uh, they had said that local polls should be held. Minus the OBC quota here, uh, because uh, the survey was conducted. It was a rapid survey, OBC survey of uh, 2017 that this was being based on. The High Court has also rejected uh, the Uttar Pradesh government's rapid OBC survey of 2017. Meanwhile, they have quashed the government's notification on the local polls as well, uh, which uh, pertain to OBC quota in Uttar Pradesh. Uh, so basically, a setback for the Yogi government, where the High Court is. saying no obc quota in up local polls the high court is quashing the government notification now on local polls the high court has rejected the up government's rapid obc survey of 2017 the other two opposition parties that is the samajwadi party and the congress had attacked the up government on this obc quota issue the samajwadi party and the congress uh, had insisted that uh, local polls uh, be held with any sort of obc quota through this survey saurav is now joining us with more details saurav take us through uh, the significance of this uh, how are we uh, to read this entire case uh, it's a very important and big story in context of up politics and maha big blow to up government so today uh, alabad uh, bench of lucknow court has said uh, that uh, this So this uh, this uh, uh, bench has clearly said that uh, uh, until the triple test conditions mandated by Supreme Court is completed in all respects by the state government, no reservation for the backward class of citizens shall be provided. That is the judgment of uh, uh, UP's Allahabad uh, High Court, and uh, that is why now all the opposition parties are att attacking BJP. Um, uh, and uh, and the order clearly says that this time urban local body elections in Uttar Pradesh will be held without OBC reservation. It which means that uh, uh, there will be no OBC reservations. Uh, there are more than 760 local body seats, and, uh, and the, the court has also cancelled the notification of 5th December. Uh, Justice Devendra Kumar Upadhyay and Justice Saurabh Lavanya. uh they heard this petition in fact they were they clearly asked during the hearings also that government should uh, support their argument with data the data government has given for reservation was not satisfying court has said and the uh, court has also uh, said that since the term of municipalities has either ended or shall be coming to an end on 31st one and the mm. process of completion of triple test condition being uh underway is likely to take considerable time it is directed that the state election commission hmm. shall notify the elections immediately and uh, they have instructed the election commission of up also to hmm. notify elections and and hold elections without obc reservation because government failed to provide them the data on which they have okay. given reservation and then the, and the notification and that government in their petition said that uh, the data they have given uh, it, it is on the basis of 2017 and 2012 and apart from that now akhilesh yadav also tweeted that uh, government is against obc uh, in fact uh, one important ally of yogi government mm. uh, anupriya patel apna dal s she is also attacking uh, bjp and she is also saying that she is also talking to her lawyers they may go to supreme court okay. against this order mm. keshav morya who is deputy chief minister of uttar pradesh maha mm. uh, he has said that uh, he uh, the government is taking legal consultation they have just Uh, received the copy of order they are going through it and they will speak with their legal experts and then they will take final call about it but according to my sources maha 
government, UP government will go to Supreme Court against the order of Allahabad court because it is going to hurt BJP a lot because uh, mm. uh, we all know that in this uh, in previous, previous assembly election, backward reservation was a major issue um, against BJP. That is why they have lost badly in Eastern Uttar Pradesh. So they dwell in Western Uttar Pradesh, but Eastern Uttar Pradesh, uh, some Aswadi party leaders like Akhilesh Adav, LI, uh, uh, Akhilesh Adav's LI, Congress has Morya, OP Rajbar, they all were attacking BJP for uh, being anti OBC and anti Dalit. So mm. now this judgment will scratch their own further. Now, uh, BJP, as I said, that Kesha Morya is saying that they are uh, taking legal opinion and uh, soon they will take some final call. Okay. But in, according to my sources, they will go to Supreme Court mm. against the judgment of Allahabad High Court.